Okay, you created a page, but you notice it's really long and you want to break it down into sections. In order to do this, you have to insert page breaks and you have the option of uh, one read more button. It gives you the ability to just read more about the article. Or you can break it up into many pages. Okay, you'll notice this page is pretty long. It has a lot of videos and kind of scrolls all the way down the page. Okay, in order to break it down into multiple pages, we have to edit the article. Okay, and once the article is ready for editing, we have to insert our page breaks. So I'm not going to go over all the technical details of everything here, but this is just text. Um, this is the real player markup for that metal assault radio that's on the page. And then here we're going to insert a page break. So if we just go to the end of the line, hit enter, it gives us a new line. Then we can just choose page break down here. And we have to enter a page title now page title is going to be used to separate each page of the article. It's also going to be used for a little index that appears up on the right. So I'm going to call this next page Paint It Black. I'm not going to put a contents alias and then you click the insert page break, page break button. Now we can see we can see we have our page break there. I'm going to move this text close as I can get to it and then go up and delete this text and then close the gap. Ooh, don't close the gap. Now we can do the same thing for the next one. Just hit enter. Choose page break. Into the page title, choose insert page break, move it up a little bit, go up, delete the text, now we can move up a little bit, and now we have to insert the read more. Okay, the insert read more uh, button is going to show a button that says either read more or any text that you want to put in the button. Uh, we're going to show an example of how to do that now. I want to create a new line and then enter the read more button. Now Actually, I stand corrected. You cannot change the read more uh, button text from this front end editor. It can be changed in the parameters when you uh, edit an article in the uh, administrator panel. However, for our purposes here, a generic read more button will suffice. Clean up a little bit here. Ooh. Leave well enough alone. Now we should go up and save the article. And we don't have to mess with all the other fields, we just edited it. Okay, once your article is saved, you can see the title How to Insert Page Breaks in Your Article. This is the first page that we created. It shows the text. This page shows comparison of new artists to original singers. It also shows how to create page breaks. If you want, you also may listen to some really metal music. Check this out. Come on. Okay, you'll notice down here on the left, you see a next, 
and the previous next. This is the navigation. Um, at the end of this video, I'll show you how to make sure this navigation is turned on in the administrator. This um, navigation down here navigates you from article to article. So if you're in the list, and currently we are in the video community, or web community video docs list of articles, this will scroll us through each article at a time. This navigation is what scrolls you from page to page within the current article and it also goes by this article index and these are, um, this is the original title for the article, this is the first page, then when we created the uh, page break and gave it a title, this was what we used also here, here's for all pages, now we can scroll through to the next page. Now you see that we only have two. Before we had four. Now we're going to choose next. You notice we have two again. Um, and for some reason, I read more about it. Okay, to find out why the read more button didn't work, we're going to edit the article. I'm going to try to put it in there again. Um, actually, this is it. So look at the code. Okay, a quick check on this article in the administrator. We're going to try to get that read more to work. It's possible that it will not work with. It's hard to see in this administrator. The background is kind of dark. I'm going to delete it. I'm going to insert it again. And then up here in the parameters, you can change the alternative read more text. I'm going to say um, video tutorial. And then I'm going to save the article. Actually, I'm just going to apply the article. I need to make more no changes real quick, I don't have to go through that hole. Once again, I'm going to go back over here. see this right now. Okay, edit the article. I'm sorry, don't edit the article. We currently have the article within uh, the administrator. I'm going to go to next page. Scroll down until we get to the bottom. Again. And then still doesn't work. So it's possible that that doesn't work um, in union with uh, page breaks. So I guess the answer to this, the solution to this little nightmare right here is to not use the read more with page break, I guess. Um, I know the read more does work because I use it in many other places. All these menu items up here are actually articles. Um, 
um, that just have a read more and then the button. Read more in the button, read more in the button, and I have them set up as um, in a group for uh, news, not newsletters, um, news flashes. And that's how that's set up. But read more does work, it just may not work with the line breaks or the page breaks.